Rochester Institute of Technology is once again at the forefront of innovation. The new University Services Center has earned the highest sustainability rating from the U.S. Green Building Council. Its Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design, or LEAD rating, is platinum. YNN's Virginia Butler has more on what it all means. 77% of uh, people working in the building have a view to the outdoors while they're even working in their office spaces. The first thing you notice about the Student Innovation Center, a lot of glass. It's part of the $15 million University Services Center. New technology means the glass does more than just allow a nice view. We're really able to now open up the, the brick walls with more glass. Um, because we could now block the UV light and re reduce the heat gain to a manageable uh, amount and therefore um, we could bring all the daylight in. User friendly, energy efficient and among only a handful of lead platinum buildings in New York State. The high rating wasn't in the original plans. The hope was to get lead silver. Um, as the team started meeting and talking about the site and the situation, it was really, we all looked at each other and said, we can achieve platinum. So how sustainable and energy efficient does a building have to be to achieve platinum status? Well, it has 48.6 percent energy cost reduction over industry standards for heating and cooling efficiency, 43 percent reduction in water usage over national requirements, 35 percent of the building's electricity is supplied from renewable sources, including on-site solar panels, 33 percent recycled content of materials and materials and products necessary for the project from within a 500-mile radius. The kicker, it didn't cost RIT any more to build the building this way. It's getting easier. Product manufacturers are all jumping on board, so it's easier for architects and engineers to select products um, that are more sustainable in nature to incorporate into buildings. Um, Ten years ago is pretty hard. I think it's penetrated the industry. Um, you know, and if anybody, you know, whether you get a certification or not, building sustainably helps the environment and helps our future and future generations. So it's a good thing to do. It does take more effort, but also it's, it's not a, a drab to do it because you know that in the long term, the colleges or the RIT will really um, gain from it. RIT intends to remain in the lead when it comes to sustainability. Another lead platinum building is in the works. Virginia Butler, YNN.